I think chasing is continuing to be aggressive being itself. I'm being myself uh, at the same time. Never before in Celtics history have we seen a scoring combo quite like Jason Tatum and Jalen Brown. Tatum and Brown each broke the 30-point barrier again Sunday night in Denver, marking the second straight game during which they've accomplished that feat together. It's also the sixth time this season that they've done so together, which is two more than any other duo in Celtics history. There's no question about it. These two guys are rolling right now, and it's no surprise that the Boston Celtics are following suit. Him and Jalen, you know, getting the 30-30s again, and they've been doing that, you know, to some extent lately. And I think everybody else feeding off them, the crowd as well, it, it helps us, and our guys are ex uh, extra motivated tonight. There's nothing that, you know, we go into the game trying to do. It's just uh, playing the right way, moving the ball, and taking the shots that you're supposed to take. I think Jason is continuing to be aggressive being himself. I'm being myself uh, at the same time. Sunday night's win sets the Celtics up to potentially sweep this four-game West Coast swing when they take on the Oklahoma City Thunder Monday night. The Thunder have lost nine straight games, but the Celtics will be playing on the second night of a back-to-back. Tip-off comes at you live Monday night at 8 p.m., and you can catch the game on NBC Sports Boston. Reporting for Celtics.com, I'm Mark D'Amico.